Welcome back to the coaching journey. Bali Ben in Arizona State is doing everything it needs to do to kind of stand pat. They have about four games left to go in the regular season. And Utah's up next. We need some of this. We don't need to meet the coaches. All right, another disciplinary action. That's what you want to see from your freshman linebacker. Now Utah's 4-4 four four in the season. Arizona State ranked ninth, trying to make their way back up the ranks. They're losing to Oregon again. First time Coach Bolly Ben gets to face his old team after winning the national championship last year. Go back and check out that season. All right. Across the 30. So again, Arizona State does a good job of put, making pressure on the special teams and having a great opportunity to miss extra points, right? These kickers aren't great. And that's why you see Arizona State go for two-point conversions pretty much 99.999% of the time. Oh, big hit there. Cropper didn't want to take that one. Held on to the football, though, so that's a plus. Give this kid a little bit of speed and thinks he's Speedy Gonzalez, but not quite yet. The blitz is coming up the middle. Able to see it. Pick it up. Gain of seven. Junior quarterback. Getting it done for the most part this season. Again, the only loss, there's mostly fumbles in that game and some just bad plays. And a loss of two, speaking of bad plays. Second quarter's over. Get the ball to the guy that makes good plays. Stud tight end freshman. Swift. And Moxie gets hit out of bounds. Gain of six. Over 100 receptions already for this Cropper kid. This is how Coach Bolly Ben works. Not pretty. Not aesthetically pleasing the way he wins football games. But when you play on extreme mode, you know, you don't have a lot of great players. You got to do what you got to do and play what the cards are dealt. Gain of four. Getting close to that minute mark. Again, pick. Where you want to go? Oh, boys. Bad route there, but it's going to be made up right there by Swift. Gets rewarded. Right place, right time. Tight end. Does his job. Audible it up. Get up and over. Good job, Cropper. Give the kid some gloves. And missed. And they go for a field goal. So 16 seconds left. Okay, not terrible. Not a lot of time, though, to get. They're going to need. A really big chunk play from their tight end, most likely. And gets out of bounds. Okay. So they don't have any audibles left. So where are they going to go? Intercepted. Not what you want to see because that is a field goal range. Hail Mary. What the fuck? That's the stupidest thing I've ever seen. They go, Utah gets the Hail Mary. That's not what you want. Just take a knee. Extreme football. Now, instead of taking the lead here in this drive, Arizona State's looking to tie it, right? So they got to kind of go quick to give them some time in that fourth quarter. So nice job there. Cross the 50 yard line. They're going to try to move quicker than normal. Not their tempo they want to play at. They like playing the methodical tempo. Tempo. Cross the 40. Get out of bounds. Stop the clock. And, oh, that was a bad idea. Just let the ball drop, I guess. Oh, nearly picked off again. Comebacker. Able to get the right time there. Nice job. And the first down. And Moxie gets hit right in the chest. Not well, much you can do on that. Trying to score a little quicker. Again, you want to give yourself enough time in that fourth quarter. And he gets it down. A little soft on Moxie there. Inside the five-yard line. And a touchdown. There you go, Cropper. Two-point conversion is going to be a must here. Gets the out. Gets the two-point conversion tie game. 33 seconds to go in the third quarter. Let's go defense. Held him to a field goal. 
defense, goal line stand, field goal for Utah, and a good chance here for Arizona State to run the clock out and do it their way. Uh oh, they're going for big. This might not be great. The big return by Bush. Nice kickoff return. Longest under Coach Polly Ben, but uh, now at least they're in the field goal range, but they got to take a lot of time off this clock and get a touchdown to walk this off. So they got the balls in their court on this one for sure. Now you got to get a first down, too. You don't want to give them the ball back with too much time if you're going to have to kick a field goal. All right, it's going to be fourth down in inches. You know what they're doing here. And you know what they're doing here. First down. What a return, man. That changes everything. Gain a nine. Okay. Gets about the 12-yard line. Got the first down. All right. So what to do here on first down and goal? And another five-second runoff. To the goal line. They got it. Make it here. Touchdown with four seconds left to go. ASU is going to come back from this one, huh? Intercepted in the end zone. They got a three-point lead, and that is the game. No Hail Mary on this one. Interception at the end of half almost cost them. Not a great idea, but here we go. We're back at it. Another victory. And let's get this guy some speed, why don't we, right? Washington State's going to come up next here in week 12. See you guys next week. Go to Washington State. Play the Cougars.